The most popular sport in Africa, as in most countries of the world, is football. But there is an exception. For example, in the West African country of Senegal, there is a peculiar kind of wrestling. It is called the Senegalese wrestling, or in the local lawn. Its popularity here is extremely high. Competitions always gather full stadiums of fans, which, by the way, football matches cannot always boast of, despite the fact that everyone loves football in Senegal. <laughs> The history of Senegalese wrestling goes back centuries. Then, during fights, along with wrestling, all kinds of blows were allowed. Kicks, punches, elbows, head, and even bites. Many fighters specially grew their nails to use them during the fight and blind the opponent, which was also not prohibited by the rules. Some wrestlers even specially sharpened their teeth in order to bite off the ears of their opponents during the fight, and then make a necklace out of them. Over time, the rules became more stringent. But, until now, Senegalese wrestling remains the only type of martial arts in which it is allowed to strike with bare fists, without any protection. Lam is not just a fight. This is a whole religion occult. The fusion of Islam and local beliefs eventually gave this struggle mysticism and ritualism, an integral part Lam are her rituals. <laughs> Before the start of the duel, the rivals put on sacred amulets, whisper spells, pour themselves over with specially prepared sacred water, a sarof, the composition of which includes very strange ingredients, such as the hair of lions and hyenas, the milk of a gazelle, the roots of secret sacred trees. This water has the right to cook only marabouts. Some holy people, leaders of mystical Muslim communities, depending on the instructions received from marabouts, Wrestlers pour this liquid on their hands, feet, or even take it inside. Each individual elixir has a special composition and a special purpose for use. For example, if a wrestler pours an elixir of pig's milk over his head, this will help to undo the plot cast by the opponent's marabout. And, so let's go directly to the duel itself. The essence of the struggle is to knock down the opponent and force him to touch the whole body, or four limbs of the ground, while you can use blows to the head and face. They don't fight on the ground, there are no weight categories. Considering that some wrestlers can weigh up to 145 kg, sometimes such fights end in knockouts after 10 seconds, but they usually last 34 minutes, the first one to fall loses the fight. The winner becomes the king of the arena, receives fame and money. Thousands of teenagers dream of becoming the king of the arena. They train hard on the beaches and playgrounds of the whole country. Often they start their wrestling career in unofficial competitions, which are usually held at night, in deserted places. So, gradually young wrestlers gain experience, physical strength, and in time they can take part in one of the official tournaments of the country. For winning such a tournament, you can get a cow, a car, or a substantial cash prize. This is an incentive for their further professional growth. At this level, wrestlers gain weight and build muscle mass through long, intense workouts. They do not get out of the rocking chairs, realizing that strength and mass decide, because in the Senegalese wrestling, if you are larger and more massive, then it is harder to dump you on the ground. The fighting season lasts 11 months a year, with the exception of August, when special tournaments are held called Fight of the Century. Absolutely everyone follows these events, including radio and television. The winner's cash prize in such a tournament can be more than 100 zero. And given that the average monthly earnings in the country are a little over 100, the winners are Senegalese stars. They are incredibly popular. They are universally recognized by face. They are the idols of the Senegalese youth. This attitude towards lomb wrestling has made it the main national sport in Senegal. It can even be called part of the life of Africans, their tradition and culture. <laughs> Is a pop, 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 is a pop